And then I... I woke up from my short dream. <sighs> Color gradually returned to my black and blacked out vision. The lamp started to come back into focus. I could tell immediately that the world line had changed. I could still see Carissa when I closed my eyes, but she wasn't in the development room anymore. It was like the whole thing had been a daydream. I felt like I had been caught in a boundary between dreaming and wakefulness. I was back. Back to a world without Kurisu. This was the, wasn't the alpha world line. There was no point in even bothering to check. A moment ago only Kurisu and I had been in this room. And now everyone was here. Oh, Yuki here? I need someone to cheer me up. Yeah. It's okay. お薬飲みますか平気だよ心配ないルカカ朝<笑> え、ママがえ、あ、すみません。僕手伝わない方がいいですか? ママが作れるの? いや、I looked around at everyone and then back at Kagari. Kagari-san. やだな、オカリン-san. 私のことはカガリでいいって言ってるのに。Something was different. Kagari. Saki. Mayuri no koto nante yonde da ka. Kite mo ii ka. Eh? Nante te. Mama da yo? Doshite mo nani mo. Mama wa mama da mo. Ne? Mama? And there goes everything. I felt uh, vaguely dizzy watching my ear, my ear fidget and embarrassment. Why? Did I really, did I really tell him them that? Did I tell them something so important? ごめんなさい。僕聞くつもりはなかったんですけど、耳に入ってしまって。Lukaku lowered his head in apology. あ、でも大丈夫です。
それに僕ちょっとだけ嬉しかったんです皆さんと秘密を共有できて本当は直接教えてもらえればよかったんですけど Even Lukaku knew about Mayuri and Kagari, which meant that, of course. でも驚きましたタイムマシンとか未来とかお話の世界のものだって思ってたんですけど実現できるなんて He knew about the time machine. Evidently, I hadn't simply come straight back from the Alpha World line. I was in a world line slightly different from the one I'd seen before, been in before. The divergence meter I'd used before was gone now. That meant I didn't have a precise number, but this, was all this all felt very different. The problem was finding out the same was that the same as the old world line and what was different. Kagari, I'm going to ask you. 質問させてほしい何私は、カグリーを、シャワーカグリーを、カグリーを、カグリーを、カグリーを、カグリーを、カグリーを、カグリーを、カグリーを、カグリーを、カグリーを、カグリーを、カグリーを、カグリーを、カグリーを、カグリーを、カグリーを、カグリーを、カグリーを、カグリー But、as for the world line of 2030, the world of 2036 was, and how she'd become Mayuri's daughter, she hadn't told them the details about that. Fortunately, they hadn't seemed interested in knowing about their futures. Everyone always thinks that they don't, they'd want to know what their future holds. But when the chance finally comes, fear outweighs your curiosity. The future doesn't, wasn't always a happy thing. Knowing the future might destroy your dreams. It might be a death sentence, like it was for me. Some people would lose all sense of meaning in their lives if they knew where they knew there was inevitably going to be a war in which five billion people died. So, I'm going to go to ルカコの家に居候したのがきっかけで間違いないなうんっていうかオカリンさんがママと引き合わせてくれたんだよ覚えてないのいやそういうわけじゃないんだが一応確かめておこうと思ってな一応ね変なオカリンさん Kagari going missing had happened almost exactly as I remembered it. The same、uh, was true of how she came to us. And. She was still missing some of her memories, too. In other words, in this world line, the only memories she had were of the, her childhood and of the last few weeks since she'd woken up in Shiva Mountains. The most、uh, important part was still missing. <laughs> was there anything else I needed to ask? I was staring at the floor trying to think, then I, when I realized that something was missing. You got up. Killed. さっき岡部さんが来る前に掃除しておきましたいやそうじゃなくて床に小さな穴が開いてたはずなんだが床に穴ですかラブは been attacked just last night Didn't get attacked here. During the attack, one of the bullets had left a dark hole in the floor. Oh, no, 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 no,
ってたかななかったと思うけどちなみにお前たち昨日はそのどうだった昨日のパーティーのことすっごく楽しかったよあんなに楽しかったの私初めてだった。They wouldn't say that if there had been an attack, which meant that the attack had never taken place. Was no one around, no one after Kagri in this world? No, it was too early to assume that. I still didn't know what happened when she had gone missing. Until I did, I couldn't say for sure if she was safe. Just like how sometimes my Yuri's death would occur on a different day in the Alpha World Line, the same thing might happen a few days later. In fact, it would be better to be cautious. They all started happily talking about last night's party. At least, at first glance, it was a peaceful scene. But something sinister might be happening, I just didn't know about it. No, I knew something had, be, had to be happening. The fact that the world line was changing was proof. Why had it changed anyway? I thought back to the events of that night. First, someone had taken over Amadeus. Cursu had called me and asked for help. The world line had changed and right after that I'd answered, which meant that the key was Amadeus. Did Amadeus have something to do with the world line change? And what about the group who'd attacked Kagari? Was it all connected? Maybe I needed to find out. ちゃん。時間大丈夫あ、行けない。休憩時間終わってた。店長に怒られちゃう。店長。ということは、バイトしてるのか。そうだよ。下のブラウン観光棒って。で、この前行ったじゃん。そう。In the old world line, Kagri had started working with uh, for Tenoji after the attack. There was another difference. Kagri hopped up and skipped out of the room. Her wounds, her words and mannerisms were much more childish than they had been in the last フォローライト。頑張ってね。はい。それじゃ、行ってきます。カガリ、戻る前にもう一つだけ聞かせてくれ。アマデウスという言葉を聞いて。アマデウス。カガリ、seemed to Soka. She didn't look like she was lying or being sarcastic. She must really not know and have no, uh, must not have known. I watched her leave the lab and then took out my phone. There was another thing I needed to check. That was, uh, what was happening with Amadeus? I looked for the icon on my screen. Amadeus isn't there. The AI that held Makise Kurisu's personal held Makise Kurisu's personality and memories, and the application which started the program, but the program was gone. わかったな。こんなところに呼び出して。別に構わないわ。ちょうど近くまで来てたから。
After seeing the icon missing on my phone, I did connected uh, my I'd connected Maho immediately. My goal, of course, was to see what was going on with Amadeus in this world. I had to find out. Amadeus no koto da. Maho's eyes suddenly went up, went wide. Her reaction see, surprised me as well. I'd simply said the word Amadeus. Okay, this world's way different. クリスの事件があった。あの後に凍結されたのよ。凍結された。アマデウスが。凍結ってことはつまりプロジェクト自体打ち切られたってことか。はっきり言ってしまえばそういうことね。she clenched her fist in anger. It seemed the change in this world line was a big one. Should I tell her about the world lines and the attractor field theory? I decided that it, was, it wasn't the time to tell her. I tried to explain everything. I'd, ha I'd have to tell her about D-mail and the time machine. Maho didn't seem to know at about all that. I can imagine that she'd be she'd do if she heard the truth. You know, she was yet another of those people who were entranced by the possibilities of science. No. アマデウスが凍結されたっていう話もう少し詳しく教えてくれないか理由は何だったんだ何でも外部団体からクレームが入ったんですって人の記憶を人工知能に持たせるのは人間の複製を作り出すのと同じこと神のみに許される所業だって欧米って自分たちの価値観で物を言う人が多いのよね。特にそういうデリケートな部分は。理由はそれだけなのか。ええ、少なくとも私はそう聞いてるわ。いきなり研究は中止だって言われて教授たちも随分怒ってた。Uh, the Amadeus program has stopped. Okay, babe, there's something I wanted to tell you. Shouldn't you ask your dad? Ask my Yuri. You okay with Ask my Yuri. I want a man's opinion. I see, so you're coming to me. See, so, yes, what kind of things do men like? Danger. <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> we like Ferris. Huh? What kind of gift would a man like? Oh, I see. Okay. My answer to that is that it depends on the person, I guess. Just give him fucking money. Like, that's just easiest gift. Give him a wad of fucking cash. I see. Who are you giving it to? My father? I had never been a father. So I can't imagine what kind of things they'd want as a present from their daughter. Uh. Huh. Uh. Okabe? Hmm? What do you mean by daughter? Oh. Um. No, I mean, uh, Mayuri. Huh? I was thinking about what Mayuri might do. Sorry, I got you and Mayuri mixed up. I know a good gift from a son to his father is, you know, be strong. That's the best present a son can give to the father. Okay, I understand I'll do twice as many practice swings with Samadari. Oh yeah, go ahead. 
I'm gonna throw my phone off the roof. <laughs> did that some did it have something to how do with the, the world line change too? Wait. So how did I meet Maho? We originally met with the Amadeus seminar. If that never happened. Uh, yeah. その... I asked a few questions, uh, taking care not to rouse her suspicion and managed to learn the basic story. Maho had really uh, wanted to see the place where Kurisu had died. When she finally went to Radikan, she'd run into me. Karma, or perhaps another example of attractor field convergence. It had already been decided that Maho would meet here in Akihabara. But was there some meeting in that? そうそう。Evidently, she'd gone to last night's party in this world line too. すぐにじゃないけどね。行ったでしょ。私今クリスがやっていた研究を引き継いでるの。いつまでも日本でバカンス気分を堪能してるわけにいかないのよ。そうか。But <笑> still, she was only injured fan for another 10 days. I hope nothing would happen during that. You didn't just fucking say I hope nothing would happen during that time. Why did you say anything? Amadeus had been shut down and no longer existed. No longer would I hear Kurisu's voice, and after I said goodbye to Maho, what that meant really started to sink in. I could still feel the Kurisu's warmth in my chest. Her smell. All the feelings I had tried to forget were coming back now that I'd seen her. No one will ever be happy in this world line. Everyone will be uh, miserable. That's what she had said. I knew that. That's why I decided to stay here. But that didn't mean I would. Er I could erase the sense of loss I felt. I went back to the lab to get all the together in my head. The cause of the attack in the last world line was Kagari. And there was a, a good cha chance that Amadeus was involved in the world line change that took place afterward. But in this world line, the lab had never been attacked. And the Amadeus project had been cancelled while it was still in the research stage. And, uh, yeah, okay. Fuck. That meant that the two major fields, uh, factors in the events that had occurred so far no longer existed. If they were gone, maybe there was no need to worry too much. Yeah, okay. But even so, there was still a tiny alarm going off in the back of my mind. Why had Amadeus been shut down? What happened to Kagari's missing memories? If nothing else, I might need to learn the answers to those two questions. <laughs> I thought for a while, then took out my phone and booted up the Rhine application.
Sheena Calgary felt happier from and more fulfilled than the people around her thought she was. Her memories were missing. All she had were memories when she was young. All, she had gone to the past where she was 10 and had then got separated from Suzo. Her memories afterward were a total blank in the exception of the last few weeks. Her oldest memories uh, after her childhood were the, of the ceiling she saw when she woke up. It was the ceiling of an old temple that stay, with stains here and there and it looked like faces. She remembered being a little scared. Shortly after that, she's going given to the Yanabayashi Shrine. Kagari-san, ocha nomimasu ka? Oh, oh, arigato, Ruka-kun. Ja, idemasu ne. That was when she'd met Ushurabaki Luka, Ushurabaha Ara Luka. Fuck, I can't, oh, I can never say their name. At the time, she hadn't realized that she had already known him. Ushibara Luka was a good friend with, with her adopted mother, Shinaga Mayuri. He'd played with her a lot when they were kids. When she was younger, she'd always thought he was a woman. To Kangri's young eyes, he had been a strong grown-up woman. At the time, they had always wondered why Suzai would call him Big Brother. Hi, Dozo. Arigato. But the Luca in front of her now was far younger than one she had known. He looked like a pr very pretty girl. And not nearly as strong. God, I hope Luca's just absolutely jacked, but like out of his out of his mind. So she'd only realized that he was the Ushurbia Fara Luca she knew after meeting her mother. Improving your memory and finding lost memories seemed like totally different things to her, but she didn't say so. She thought the thought made her very happy. Luca, Mama, Mayuri, and the rest of Okabe's friends were all trying to help her get her memories back. It would probably make more most people nervous not having their memories. It would be hard not knowing what you'd experience. But to be honest, Kagari didn't think she needed to remember. Sometimes it seemed like a memory was about to come back. Each time her mind would roar with a sense of fear and anxiety. <laughs> Luca saw that she'd only taken a sip and stopped and he seemed worried. She took a sip of tea, hoping to change the subject. <laughs> no, I'm just fucking her with y'all. I'm actually a girl. Jesus. <laughs> 